Well, I started teaching in 1962 in Bronslow Secondary Boys School in Gessley in the Rhondda Valley. And I really enjoyed there because you really got close to the young people, you got to know the staff well, and it was a good teaching and learning atmosphere. You got to know their backgrounds, many of the parents we knew. People used to say it was tough, but I don't think so, it was a very caring school. For example, if a young person was not at school for, say, two days and we didn't know, we didn't have feedback from any of the other pupils, then we would go and knock their door and find out what was wrong. It is that sort of caring atmosphere. Not to chastise the, the young person for not coming to school, but just to find out what the situation was. And as a result, we had very, very little absenteeism. And then, of course, came this big shock. <laughs> um, we were merging uh, with five other schools into one comprehensive school in 1965. And uh, we all came together at the new comprehensive school in Triochi, and it was then called the Upper Ronda Comprehensive School. And it was a big shock for us all. From being a small unit with eight staff, we were suddenly about 40 plus staff and 600, 700 young people. I taught PE, gymnastics, games and athletics and all the rest of it. And uh, I enjoyed doing that. There were aspects of the school that were excellent. We had brand new facilities. We had more money to spend on equipment. But I never settled into it because I didn't get to know most or a lot of the staff, let alone getting to know the young people as we had done in, in Braunschweig. And so I, I decided to leave and go into full-time youth work.